had some scrambled eggs and I got some porridge to eat. Some whatever raisins and cinnamon and sugar in it. Keep me going all through the uh oh. Like I was saying, it's um, got this to eat for breakfast. I just had some scrambled eggs. Now I got some porridge with uh, cinnamon, sugar, raisins, cranberries. Keep me walking. Um, I'm just chilling here under the hammock, as you can see. I've got my sleeping bag out. It got a little damp on the outside yesterday, but I think that's fine. It was when I set my tarp up, I set it up poorly because it was so sunny, I wasn't worried, and then I got caught in the rain a little bit. But uh, I slept dry, and hopefully I'll leave this out for another, it's pretty much good now, but I'll leave it out for another hour or so. We'll pack up and go. I just need to make sure to really try to waterproof my gear when I put it in my bag, which I'll do by putting in additional uh, garbage bags <coughs> and whatnot when I pack everything up. So I'm just chilling here under my hammock. I have a really good dry spot. Water bottles. I've got my food here because I'm getting ready to pack it up. This is what's left in my food bag. A couple of cans of tuna, chicken, a can of beans, and then uh, lots more porridge, mashed potatoes, baked potato, some coffee. Probably have some coffee later. Uh, I think I got a lemon and lime left. <clears throat> Unfortunately, there's been no fish caught so far. And we did end up breaking one fishing rod. So we'll see how much fishing we end up doing. But I'd like to get to our next lake early. <coughs> Pardon me. I'd like to get to our next lake early in the day so we can fish. I've heard during the rain it's a good time to try. So we'll see what happens. So this is how we frequently set up our fire. Um, it's a little bit windy and the, this wood's a little bit wet because it's been raining today. So what we've done is uh, build it up in a kind of dome around the fire. I think it gives it a little protection from the wind, but most of all, it dries off that somewhat damp wood and then you can use it, uh, you can use it throughout the night. So yeah, it's all about the dome fire. What is it? Morning four? Morning four? Morning three, I believe. Morning three. Morning three. Tomorrow's the last morning and we'll be heading out. Whoops. We're back on Ragged Lake. We're just out here on these rocks and we have a nice, uh, pretty nice entrance to our uh, campsite. As you can see, the lake's really, really nice. The water's calm. We're hoping it'll stay that way. The sun is shining. Uh, yesterday was just pure, rainy, cloudy. Not really amazing. It was pretty cold overnight, but. Yeah, uh, now it's uh, now it's warming up and yeah, things bad. are good. Okay, we're here on Paddy's Lake and uh, there's a little frog in front of me. I'm just gonna poke him a little bit. Boop. He's hanging out. So we just got there, it was a short hike from our campsite. Um, there's no path, but just this kind of abandoned lake. As you can see, it's a pretty nice scenery. It wasn't too bad of a hike here. Um, there's some decent spots along the shore, but not where we came in. Maybe over there where there's grass, but uh, yeah, or those rocks way on the other side, but yeah. Anyway, Paddy's Lake. So it's filming out already, yeah. Okay, so it might be kind of hard to see, but I saw a YouTube video where he kind of braided grass to make a, um, a rope. And I wasn't sure how well it would work, but 
it's really, really hard, right? And all I did was weave it together. I don't think I've ever done this before, so obviously you can get better as you try it more times, but yeah, you can definitely make a strong rope out of this stuff. Battery's still going. All right, so it's the last night on the last day. So tomorrow we'll basically be packing up, shipping out. It's a bit of traveling back to um, parking lot, but not too bad. Sure, I might have something in my teeth. Hopefully not for this video. So we got a little stack of wood going there. Got the fire. Um, what did we do today? We went on a little hike, a little swim. Canoed around the same uh, lake, Ragged Lake, exploring a bit. I swam out, not sure if you can see, but I swam out to that island earlier and uh, there's a bit of current and it just took all of my energy away. So I've been like, been a bit down, just like, oh, trying to recuperate, get some dinner in me. But I uh, feel a little better and uh, more energetic. Um, we're just gonna hang out. Got a little bit of whiskey we saved for the last night. We're gonna have that. And um, we're just about to hang the bear pack the last time. And then a good breakfast in the morning and uh, on the way home. We're thinking as a victory meal, Montana's or something of like that. Something <laughs> greasy, something greasy is what we need. All right, that's all. So I've just woken up, picking up the bag, um, and this morning we're just going to pack up and get out of here. Um, not going to lie, the rain did take it out of me, and uh, it's a bit of a chilly morning, so just looking to eat, eat some food, pack up. Apparently the paddle back can be bad if the wind picks up, so we'll see how that goes, but I don't think either of us are too worried. <laughs> 